My name is Farah Qadir. Uh, my area of expertise is a whole range from clinical all the way to well-being. Uh, it's actually over 20 years now. Fairly diverse, um, the US, the UK, um, initial schooling in Pakistan. Uh, I went to Boston College for my undergrad and for my master's in psychology. And then I moved to London, the Institute of Psychiatry, King's College, um, for my PhD. Um, I'd, I'd like to say, again, I focus more on enhancement and well-being. Um, I believe in the potential uh, and the idea is to unleash um, so that the individual is able to achieve their full potential. So it's an eclectic approach. Um, it incorporates a whole range of dimensions. Um, I want to address the past, so somewhere psychodynamic also comes in. There's a lot of CBT, uh, something called uh, compassion-based uh, psychotherapy. Um, so I work with that as well. The focus being to make it as unique and individualized, so it's more sort of bespoke. Well, I mean, coaching itself is uh, a completely different dimension. Um, it's radically different from psychotherapy. Psychotherapy is dealing with issues, problems, hardcore mental health concerns. Coaching is more like if you end up in a, in a sort of a life in class and you want to move beyond. So it could be the work environment, it could be the relationship, it could be um, any other factor that's sort of disturbing your school, uh, a, a change of profession, etc. Um, so all of those things would be incorporated under life coaching and um, executive coaching. I worked with a lot of um, C-suite individuals at an individual level. I also worked with the corporate sector uh, with bigger organizations for the sake of confidentiality and not going to take specific names. Like I said, it's, it, it's a lot of empathy. I think if there's one word, it's believing in the individuality of that person and the uniqueness of their process, but also being able to help them generalize where else they're going and be able to be comfortable in the environment that they're in. So it starts with the individual, very subjective, very individualized, and then moving towards a bigger frame of their loved ones and their family and the society in general.